Mazda Miata Expert Review Since it was introduced in 1989, the MX-5 Miata has become one of the world's most popular sports cars. This tiny two-seat convertible focuses on distilled driving dynamics, sacrificing practicality and features for the sake of pure driver involvement. The current fourth-generation ND Miata was introduced for model year 2016, and is offered with either a folding soft top or retractable hard top. What's new? Chevron Kinematic Posture Control System aims to improve handling. Wireless Apple CarPlay added to the club trim. Light Gold Platinum Quartz Metallic added to paint options. Terracotta Napa Leather Seat Upholstery becomes available. Starting price increases to $28,315. As other sports cars battle for more power, more grip, more speed, the Miata just grins and lets its top back. Mazda's icon doesn't pack numbers that earn bragging rights, but that hardly matters, it's one of the greatest driver's cars of all time. The Miata proves that fun doesn't hinge on massive engines and Autobahn braking speed. Instead, it takes a back-to-basics approach to provide its drivers with a nearly unfiltered connection to the machine surrounding them. From its precise steering to zingy, rev-happy engine, to crisp brakes, every input to the wheel or pedals results in direct responses. Then there's its manual shifter, which is absolutely delightful to rifle through. It's tempting to choose a sports car because it has insane horsepower, makes a lot of noise, or set a record lap time on some faraway racetrack. The Miata has none of that. However, what the Miata offers like few others is a joyous, exuberant experience on any road. Need proof that it's more fun to drive a slow car fast than a fast car slow? Get behind the wheel of a Miata. The Miata is offered exclusively with a 2.0-liter inline four-cylinder engine producing 181 horsepower and 151 pounds to foot of torque. That's all sent to the rear wheels through a glorious six-speed manual transmission. No automatic is available. Nope. Okay. Fine, the Miata can be had with a six-speed automatic, but it's not the transmission you want. The Miata's manual is one of the best in any car, anywhere. In motor trend testing, a 2019 Miata Club manual accelerated from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.7 seconds. A stick shift RF Grand Touring model did the same in 5.8 seconds. EPA rated fuel economy is estimated at 26 34 of a mile per gallon city slash highway for manual models, and 26 35 of a mile per gallon with the automatic. For 2022, Mazda developed a new system called Kinematic Posture Control. KPC, that is intended to improve the Miata's already excellent handling. In cornering, KPC breaks the inside rear wheel to tighten the turning radius and reduce body roll. KPC can also function when accelerating through a corner, adding to the effectiveness of the Miata's limited slip differential. Since it's entirely software-based, KPC has the lowest weight penalty possible, zero. With its standard soft top, the Miata might have the fastest folding roof of any convertible. The manually operated top can be flipped back in seconds. There has never been a hard top Miata, at least, not exactly. Outside of concepts, renderings, and super limited JDM models, the Miata RF is the closest thing there's ever been to a production Miata coupe. Indicating that it is a retractable fastback, the Miata RF has a power-operated retractable Targa roof panel, which folds in 12.5 seconds. Trunk space is not affected, but the RF weighs about 100 pounds more. So what's better, Miata convertible or RF? Choose the soft top if you want the ultimate open-air driving experience. Get the RF for better protection from the elements or security while parked, or if you're tall, the RF lacks a seat height adjuster, which affords a little more headroom. Every Miata is equipped with dual front and side airbags. Front automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, Blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert are also standard. On the Grand Touring trim, traffic sign recognition and curve adaptive headlights with automatic high beams are added. This should come as no surprise, but the Miata isn't the most spacious vehicle out there. Space for passengers and cargo is limited, making the Miata perhaps better suited as a weekend toy than a daily driver, we applaud those committed drivers who manage to use it every day. Of course, headroom increases significantly when the top is down. 
The Miata runs a 7.0-inch infotainment touchscreen, which uses Mazda's last-generation user interface. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are standard, with wireless CarPlay functionality added on the club and Grand Touring trims. There's also a small 4.6-inch display in the gauge cluster. Two USB ports are standard. Base models have a 6-speaker audio system, while a club and Grand Touring trims get a 9-speaker Bose premium arrangement with a long-standing Miata feature, speakers integrated into the headrests. The good news is that every version of the Miata is brilliant. But if we had to choose one, we'd probably go for a soft top convertible and club trim with the Brembo BBS Recaro package, it seems like peak Miata. The soft top is appealing for its slightly lighter weight. In addition to the Bilstein suspension dampers, front shock tower brace, and limited slip differential that the club trim brings, that package delivers on its name with red painted Brembo brake calipers, Motorsport YBBS multi-spoke wheels, and more bolstered Recaro seats.